So what is one of the clues that you could be dealing with a covert narcissist? Well, I'm going to tell you. When you're trying to resolve conflict with a covert narcissist, all right, and you're sitting there and you're trying to have a discussion with them and you're going, you know, you're stating the facts and everything like that and you're trying to plea your case in a sense to the covert narcissist, you're waiting for them to validate you. They're wait you're waiting for some kind of um affirmative reaction reaction where they say, "Oh, okay, I see what you're saying" or yeah, that makes sense or anything like that. And guess what that covert narcissist does? They say nothing, all right? They sit there in radio silence and they look at you or they may walk out on you because they don't like what you're saying. What they're doing is they're dismissing you and they're not about to resolve conflict with you because they don't like what you're saying because you may be calling them out on it. So a covert narcissist is gonna react by being silent, all right? They're not gonna sit there and resolve the conflict because you know what? They know that you've got the goods on them and they can't face that shame. So they're gonna stay silent. And if they're staying silent or they don't walk out on you, they're sitting there thinking about how they're gonna get back at you later on in a passive aggressive manner, all right? Because they're not transparent and they're not gonna sit there and tell you, you know, what's